Well, hello everyone. Welcome back to Breath of Fire. Now, this game was intriguing enough for me to want to spend some more time on, and we're definitely going to condense the material in here a little bit more than we did last week. But, um, basically what we're running into here is I need to... Oh, stop missing running away. You're better than that. Uh, but basically what we're doing is we need to figure out um, how to get through the little castle area in this town that we're already in. I imagine that it involves something along the lines of needing to find some sort of equipment that will let us uh, break equipment. Yeah, and either we get that by purchasing it somewhere as far as I can guess, or we will get it based off of leveling up to some certain level of combat. Um, so I'm gonna make my way through uh, these general areas and we'll see uh, if I end up finding what I need in order to uh, progress through that story element there. Okay, we can come along the coastline here, but it doesn't look like it's going to get us anywhere, so let's backtrack. Oh! So that's how that's meant to work. That's really good to know. Well, now that we can crawl through more of this dungeon, you know, we've got uh, some things that we can unlock. Let's go ahead and look at what that bronze sword does. Uh, we'll want to come to our equipment. Uh, that's definitely better than the sword that we're currently using, so let's go ahead and do that. And continue to make our way through here and see where we end up. Uh, let's hit the gloom here. Hey, nice! Really nice amount of money that came out of that, too. Quite happy with that. Nothing in this large room there. But let's hit into this creep. Still not enough to one-shot him, which is a bit unfortunate. There we go. We should be getting pretty close to level 6 as well. Let's go ahead and open up this door. We've got more herb. And we've got a gauntlet. Let's again check our inventory and see what that's going to do for us. I mean, it's going to do more defense for us, so that's not all that bad. Can always use some increased defenses. Let's then make our way out of this basement, and now we can progress through more of this castle. Always a pretty good thing to have there. It looks like we just get to make our way down to the bottom of this uh, castle and then loop back around. So not the world's worst thing, though I am going to... Nope, I can't go around that. So we're going to go down these stairs and see what else is found. Man, there's a lot of loot in here. And that just opens up the door for us there. A suede CP. What does that do? Yeah, the armor pad's better than that. Let's make our way over here again. Doesn't look like there's anything in that larger cavern or opening there. And we've got ourselves a beak, which very quickly dispatched there. Now, I remember last week I was running into a couple of beetles and we weren't seeing that. Visor, that sounds like it should be kind of helpful. Let's go in here and, nope, whip that. Yeah, I'll take the increased defense over magic any day. I think we're going to need all the help we can get for wherever it is that we're going to end up in these fights that are sure to become of us. Now let's go ahead and 
fight this creep. And a nice one shot there. I'll definitely take that. Should be getting pretty close to a level up. Uh, don't know what that did to me. So we've got some armor. Was that armor points or probably magic points of some variety? So it did some stuff to us. Oh, but now we just get to come up here. Oh. Oh, this is a. This is gonna be a boss fight. That's gonna be fun. Ooh. Not great. Our initiative's pretty low in this fight. Ooh, we are not in a great position to take on this fight. But as long as we don't get poisoned, we should be somewhat okay. And we've got some herbs, though I don't know how much it's going to. Oh, we got two attacks there. That's really good. Let's go ahead and... Hey! Ah, dang it. That's unfortunate. So we need to get ourselves a little bit more well-equipped for that. Uh, but running around in that castle honestly isn't the worst thing. And of course, I'm all the way back here. Um, should have spiked up for that fight. And apparently I can't use those abilities in combat, which is... Or not those abilities, those herbs in combat. So we'll just need to figure out how well that goes for us. But let's uh, now make our way through this. We'll confront just about every opponent that we can. And now we're going to get poisoned, which isn't fun. But we're going to be able to get to a well where we can heal ourselves of the poison malady. Unfortunately, they don't actually deal damage to me when hitting into me like that. So I'll take that, I suppose. Come on, make your way up to the fountain, drink, and heal yourself. There we go. Doesn't say that statuses are corrected in that, but... I guess that's okay. Miss. Nope, he hit me. Kind of unfortunate, but that's alright. I don't know what AP does. I'm hoping that it increases some of my defenses against this frog. There we go, healed back up. We've got some pretty good equipment though, so I'm feeling okay about these. As we go back into them, let's see if we can just one-shot this creep. Nice. Always happy when that works out. Now, can we see... How close we are... To leveling up? I don't think we can. Um... I mean, we can see an overall experience total. But nothing else from that. We don't have any of those. It'll just be kind of interesting to see how uh, these fights continue to unravel as we make our way around this castle and back up to the top. If not, we're definitely going to grind out some levels and then go back. Yeah, there's nothing in there. That's just kind of odd. But the Gloom should be relatively easy to defeat. If I can get up to level 6, I'll attempt that fight again. Let's make our way all the way down here. Who we got? 
No, not more of these pill bugs. Let me get a- No! Stop that! I don't like the pill bugs. I really don't. Like, sure, they don't outright hurt me. Okay, let's... Come into our bag. Yeah, thank you. I just wish that I wouldn't have to use that. Any other enemy showing up should be fine. It's just the the little pill bugs. Nothing up in this. It's interesting that they have those uh, rooms set up, and yet. I don't have, uh... Hey, there's level 6. Um, but it's interesting that there's a little room set up like that when I can't fully access them. Now, this begs an important question. Do I get healed? I do not. I just gain a level, which isn't the end of the world. Uh, but let's see what having full... AP going into a fight, and we'll definitely top off with some uh, additional herb going into this fight again. And hopefully it yields some better results for us. So let's go ahead and... There we go. Let's see what happens here. I have a lot of reason to be here in your castle, Mr. Frog. I will try. I would like to try again, actually. Okay, that's four. Yeah, we're not doing a whole lot of damage there. Okay, I can access my bag. Okay, and it doesn't make a whole lot of sense for me to um, guard, because staying my turn doesn't really help a whole lot of things. But now that we can see our item bag there and we can get back to it if we need to, we'll be in an okay spot. 30, that's better than some of the other hits that we've had. For I can take one more of those without worrying about being crit. Because I think he did hit me for eight one of the times that he hit me. Now let's go ahead and use an herb. Oh, I have to wait on my turn to do that. Hey, but it does fully heal me. That's good to know. That's really good to know. Um, and thank you for missing me. I appreciate that. Yeah, we've got this fight in the bag now. Okay, you can recover too. Which I suppose is only fair. If I'm capable of doing that, then you should be able to do something to that same effect. And this could be the finishing blow, and it looks like it is. No, it's not. He's got a little bit more. But let's hit him, and there he goes. Yeah, you did underestimate my strength. Hey, we reached a full new level and got a bunch of money for that. Oh, we reached two new levels from that. I suppose that's fair. This was a pretty high level fight. No, I have... There's... Okay, good. There's... There's goods in this room that I wanted to be able to collect after finishing that fight. But I think that everything has been vanquished there. And just a bunch of gold. I was kind of hoping that there would be more than just that. And of course the place is still in shambles, but we can make our way out of here now. And walk our way all the way back to the front, talk to the king, and see how uh, we get on there. And, uh, and fortunately I'm not going to be pestered by other encounters here. Nope, I don't want to go up that way because there's nothing in that general vicinity. And let's now make our way back up to the top. We'll stop off at one of these fountains and heal ourselves up. And then I should be able to progress into the next town, would be my guess. 
up these stairs. We'll touch up at the fountain here. There we go. Always nice to be fully healed. I was hoping for some really good artifacts in that room after the boss fight, but you can't win them all, I suppose. Now let's make our way out of here, and the king is no doubt going to want to address us as soon as we have exited, so let's hear what he has to say. Yes, we defeated the monsters. I... I have a scar, apparently. Oop. Uh, gotta find a quake control and put an end to the quakes. In Nanai. In the Nanai dungeon. Oh, Nanai must be the... realm that we've come from. Now, before we go anywhere, let's pop into this little save point. We'll save our adventure. Yes, please uh, regale me with the story of having hit into uh, my opponents very justly. And we'll have a quick peek around here. I don't think that there's any shopkeepers uh, that I can interact with this town, unfortunately. But can I recruit any of the members of the team to or any of the members of the village to join my party, because it seems like I'll have other party members at some point. Okay, Mr. Soldier over here, do you get to join me? Yeah, you should have fought the monsters, but instead I had to, you lazy. That's alright. Well, let's make our way back to the main area. I'm pretty sure that's what Nanai is. And uh, if not, well, we'll find out. Well, I've wandered around this map for a little bit, and I can't seem to figure out where we're meant to go next. Like, this king says there's a hidden palace in the Nanai dungeon and we need to find a quake control. But I can't get into the next town because the guards are still standing guard, and I cannot get into, well, I can get into the hometown, but there's nothing really beneficial there for me. Um, there's only one other place that I found, and I can't get around trees in order to get to where I'm meant to be there. So it's kind of a lose-lose-lose situation for me to just sit here and aimlessly wander. We will figure it out, we will get there, even if I have to look it up, which I don't overly enjoy doing, but if it's necessary to just move the plot along, then that's what I'll have to do. But thanks for watching. If you enjoyed today's video, make sure that you leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe for the daily variety content, and we'll see you in the next video. Take care, and have a great rest of your day.